Okay, so let's begin sequence five. Twenty-three is everywhere. Where? Okay. First Lieutenant Steven Yarish. Captain Lim, at ease, Trooper. Get on the horn and tell them we've secured the Penn Station bodies. I'm taking the heavy armor to destroy a hive. Get control points up in this area, then rendezvous with us at Gentech. Yes, sir. Cool beans. Cool, cool, cool beans. Next person up the bat is Captain Eric Lim. Are you up? Yay! Yay. Yay. Sir, Director McMullen surrendered the bodies to a civilian. Ragland? Yes, sir. You did the right thing, son. Your new orders are this. Recover all samples, bodies, and evidence from Dr. Ragland. Bring them to base AE-1. Ragland? If he doesn't interfere, leave him be. He's already implicated. He won't talk. And McMullen, sir. It's time for the doctor to learn who's in charge of this little excursion. Cool. Nice. Yeah. Mm. I, I just heard it again. I swear to God. I just heard it again. The whispers said, that's nice. I swear to God, it said, that's nice. I swear. Shut up, Whispers! Okay, next one is Travis Morgan. It's not Bodacious Dwayne. That is not the correct place. Oh, that. Wait, what? Okay. Where? Is it here? Okay, Travis Morgan. Karen. Karen. Let me help you. We're all in very deep here. There's only one way out. Cooperation. And if you assist us, you're free and clear. A ticket anywhere you want and a top-level assignment. And if you don't, there's nothing I can do for you. Listen, Karen. Whatever he is now, he's not the man you knew. He's something else. I want a lawyer. And stuff like that makes Karen not seem like such a heartless bitch. So next one is First Sergeant Carl Ashuleta. Ashuleta. Shut up. Is that you? Alrighty. Parker. Karen. Wait here, please. Uh, no need to. I, I forgot something. <laughs> I need to grab it before they lock us out. Wait here. Parker, Karen, employee 218, attempting to enter into main lab. Hey, stop! Halt! So what happened? Well, why, why are you just going to cut to memory there when things got interesting? You suck. Suck ass. Okay, so next one is Private Damien Loshek. Cool. Oh, Sounds what the super. hell is this shit? Looks like paprika stinks like ass. Stow it and get those tanks loaded on the chopper. Whatever it is, you better get used to it. They're spraying it over the city and us. Oh, hell. I kind of want to think that's like a disinfectant almost, that it's kind of like the blood tox, just instead of an aerosol form, it's um just liquid. So you spray it on stuff, kills the virus, stops it from being able to spread. Ah, uh, makes sense. Next one is Private Timothy 
Longoria? Longoria? Not you. Yay. Yes. Zero, we gonna pull this one out of the fire? I don't give a shit if it's Hope, Two Bluff, New York, or fucking DC. We burn out the infection until it's done, whatever the cost. Sir, New York ain't shit in the face of the other option. Just burn it. Just fucking burn it. Burn it all until it's clean. Oh. I'd say that guy was a little paranoid. Just a little. Okay, so the next one is Dr. Malcolm Fraser. Which we saw. Where are. Is that you? Yeah. You could eat this stuff, and it wouldn't do a thing. Well, how the hell are they going to feel this stuff? Just like Agent Orange. What the fuck is Agent Orange? What the fuck is Agent Orange? What is Agent Orange? <laughs> What's Agent Orange? Whatever. Um, so next one is First Lieutenant Daniel Eckert. I think I saw you too. Are you down? Well, you were, but I didn't see you, so whatever. So he's swinging behind the plane as it's trying to limp across the Hudson. Yeah. And it's waggling its wings like, don't shoot! I had a tone like a mile out. Boom! Was that Dwayne? The shit? Is that the shit they worked on at Fort Dietrich? Agent Orange? Orange. Orange. Yeah. Okay, so who, who's the next one? Um, Dennis Rickard? Okay, cool. This weapon is to be given the highest priority. I want it in the field yesterday. We're producing it as fast as we can. The Harlem facility is getting up to speed as we speak. Good. We may have just caught a break. Dismissed. Oh, so it is it is blood talks. Okay, because it showed the um the silos that I ended up blowing up. So so that is blood talks. Okay, so the next person is First Lieutenant Darren. I don't know. See that? Is it like Alpo? Alpof? Alpo. Calling you Alpo. Just give me rough projections on marine casualties. Approximately 1,000 to 2,500. No, sir. Per week. Well, fuck. That kind of sucks. Shit. Now, I don't think that was all my doing. I don't think I killed that many military folk. I'm going to blame that. Or the walkers. Excuse me. So the next one is um Paul Evans. Is that you? Nice. Well, they'd come in just as happy as you please. Hell, they'd roll up the damn sleeves for you. What were you injecting them with? And, and when was this? That was the summer of mm, 1963. Damn it if I know what it was. All I know is. I didn't want to inject it into me. So that's talking again about Hope, Idaho. I, uh, I think, at the very least. I think that was nicely insinuated. 
Um, and the people basically didn't know what the fuck they were using, so that's fun. Um, I think that's kind of like a medical malpractice, not knowing what you're injecting into people, but whatever. Captain Daniel McCaskill? Yeah, that name there. I've seen this footage before. But you weren't paying attention. Watch, watch it again. Watch it again. He uses the code to open the door right after consuming the target. target. That code was only known to three people. What if Zeus is collecting mines like a child collects moths? What if he has access to everything anyone he consumes has seen, done, or heard? This would explain several things. It's knowledge of Black Watch tactics. Its ability to pilot aircraft in armor, something Mercer had no training in. As well as its uncanny skill in rooting out sleeper personnel. This would also be very, very bad for all of us at Black Watch. Soup. Toad soup. Whole lot of soup. Soup soup. Soup. I'm gonna stop saying soup now. So, cool beans. Fun stuff. And next one is Dr. Jared Cooper. Yay. Let's see what he has to say. And what if this parasite gets out of Mercer? That's not our concern. We're supposed to be stopping these things, not manufacturing new ones. So instead of, uh, you, well, I should have picked up on that before when they called it a parasite rather than, you know, like an antivirus. Hmm. So I still want to know if Cross was, if Cross was the baby, some other runner that consumed the original Cross, or if he was this new parasite, like he got infected with the new parasite somehow, and it was pretty much the same shit, I don't know. Next one is Dr. David Chapman. Blackwatch is lying. Something, Something besides Elizabeth Green came out of hope. You recall her pelvic x-rays? No. Her hip bones indicated a pregnancy. There's no record of pregnancy on her charts. Who would have the power to conceal that? talking about the baby so hopefully we get some more news about that <laughs> sorry I really hate this chair can't move and get comfortable without making any noises I'm gonna just get like a folded chair like I have at my house god shut up chair so next one is lieutenant Armand Heldon I know an Armand. I've been through three wars in this tank. I can move through city streets or open desert. Ain't nothing that can stop her. And if anything gets in my way, well, uh, damn. <laughs> I just go over it. Well, that's a weird outlook, Armand. What the hell? <laughs> I'm guessing that's another guy at eight. To get some better skills at the armors. I'll, I'll assume that anyway. Um, so next one is Dr. Stanley Washington. You have no idea what they're planning. Maybe. That doesn't make it right. Listen. They won't risk it. Even McMullen isn't that stupid. 
I've got them in check. Yeah. Problem is, they always struck me more as checkers players, Alex. Who was I talking to? Not I, but Alex Mercer. Because it said Alex, so the only Alex that they're going to name in the game is Alex Mercer, naturally, to keep shit less confusing. It sounded like him anyway. I don't know. And Dwayne says that he thinks the voice of Armand from the last video, sorry about that, was um, the guy who voiced Pierce in the Saints Row series. I don't know. Maybe. Uh, probably Googled that somewhere. <laughs> Sorry. Next one is Arthur Osborne. Is that you? Yay. There's a typo one here. 11101. Subjects Mercer, Alex J, and Parker Karen I. If I'm going down, I'm not going alone. Alex, listen, we can work this out. It's too late for that. What do you want, Alex? What can I do? I want the truth. Where did she come from? Soupy. But yeah, Wikia, you have another typo. Osborne here is spelled with an E, and you don't have that E. Boo. Nice. Okay, so where am I at? Um, Dr. Kendrick Chua. That name there, yeah. What the hell else did they pull out of that place? I mean, she's bad enough. But what else is there? What else is there? Uh, no one talks about that. If you don't want to end up in a lime pit, I'd shut up. Right now. Well, shit. That was a very helpful answer, and thank you. You helped us all out there. Now we all understand better. Yeah. No more questions. None at all. Jonas Phillips. Excuse me, is the next guy. Found you. <laughs> Everyone except the research staff was exposed. The effects, which most thought would be severe, never appeared. No one could understand why, but the virus seemed to be inert in humans. Until the births. They were wrong, but it took four years for them to realize it. What? 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 I can ban myself from chat? I just realized that. That's kind of funny. Why would I do that? It's kind of a stupid option. Can I tie myself out? Do do I need a timeout? Dwayne, do, Dwayne, do do I need a timeout? Do you think I do? I'm not waiting anymore. Okay. First Sergeant John McGraw. McGraw? McGraw? Doesn't matter. First Sergeant. I don't know. I'm not gonna tie myself out. I don't want to. Altruistic know recovered several interesting anomalies from Hope. We've only let you see some. I want access to Pariah. I'm gonna forget you know what that is, Doctor. You don't have clearance. Always remember, you work for us. Escort the Director out. Sir, if you'll just follow me, Dr. McMullen. So who the fuck is Pariah? Pariah is, I think, um, well, it's codenamed Pariah. Naturally, that's not the actual name. Like, just how Elizabeth Green is codenamed Mother, and Alex Mercer is codenamed Zeus. I th I want to think that Captain Cross is Pariah, but I don't know. Who the fuck is the kid? Well, I know it was the child in the video, Dwayne. 
but there's no children in this game so whatever next one is private first class Daniel Hull nice Barges will be moved in as temporary storage for the dead. Strict security is to be kept on these piers. These are strict no-access areas for anyone outside the group. When a barge is full, the contents will be incinerated. If this disease runs its full course, you can expect more than 4,000 barges. Nice. Awesome. Cool beans. Okay. Next one is Theodore Anderson. Theodore Anderson. Set down. Go down. No. Oh my god. No, I have to search for you? Oh my god. Wait, I'm talking about sequence 5, right? Oh no. This is six. Spoilers. Oh my god, where are you? Theodore Anderson. Why can't why isn't there just a search option? So you're not over there. Okay. Sir, we've reestablished contact with the target. You screwed me, Mitlon. Is this Alex? End this. Come in. Now. Why didn't you tell me where this sample came from? I couldn't, Alex. I couldn't risk it. Yeah, well, you fucked up. Okay, so, apparently at some point in the story, Alex called McMullen. Sorry, I screwed it in. Um, so apparently at some point in the story, Alex decided to call McMullen. And yeah, had a had a brief, pretty pretty chill conversation. Pretty ah uh, chill. Doctor William De is the next bro. Well, the last one actually. What's the word on the new round of test subjects? Sir, they're testing off the charts. No ill effects at present. No evidence of the unmodified virus. virus. Prep them for field deployment ASAP. Sir, I, I don't think we're ready. You're not paid to think. Huh. So, um, I guess the super soldiers were created from a strain of the black light virus. I think I'm getting that correctly. I think. Anyway. Yeah, it's okay, so that's the last dude in sequence number five. So shortly we'll be going to sequence six. I'm gonna get something to drink again. I'm pretty thirsty for some reason. I'm gonna get some water. Water is good for hydration. still chilly in my room. I might get a blanket. Yes, that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna get a blanket. I don't, I don't think so. Got it, buddy. Found 
me some candy. Hi there, Kilgore. One moment. There you go, Kilgore. Now you can do some fun stuff. Um. Ooh. There we go. 